hello and welcome, I think, to episode 34 of Being Frank on Ipswich Town with myself, Frank, my wife, Rung. It should be Being Frank and Rung on Ipswich Town, I suppose. But anyway, we look forward to the games on Sunday. Not Saturday, as I suggested yesterday. George and Tommy reminded me of that fact, and uh, thanks for that, guys. And um, they all kick off at the same time, 12pm. So it should be a very interesting uh, game, especially if Port Vale can take a couple of points from Plymouth. That's all that's needed. They don't get a win, they get a draw, an Ipswich win at Fleetwood. And what a dream Sunday that would be. But anyway, we should be more than grateful that we've reached um, the championship after all this time. And who are the players that we expect to be there next season? Well, I think the bulk of the squad will remain the same. I'm not too sure about Kane Vincent Young, though. I think he might go. Marcus Harness started the season well, picked up an injury, came back only half the player he was. He might also uh, disappear. I think Rikim uh, Harper, I think he'll go as well. And uh, Gasson had, had me, I've always struggled with his name. He probably not, might not be there too much longer. I hope Greg Lee stays. I hope Kyle Edwards stays. And Idris El Mazzouni, who did so well with Leighton Orient uh, this season. I hope he comes back because he could be an extra tool in the Ipswich Town midfield which includes of course Cameron Humphreys who started so well at the beginning of the season and then was pushed out by Massimo Luongo which I uh, think was fair enough because Massimo Luongo performed very very well from start to finish at the back end of the season although he does have an injury or two. Anyway I'd like to hear your views on the subject and as always thanks for tuning in Thanks for thumbs upping and thanks for subscribing. Until the next time from Frank and Rung, it's up and down.